Welcome to my channel. My name is Ashley and I love makeup. I focus on indie and affordable brands. So if that's what you're into, go ahead and subscribe to my channel if you're not already subscribed. Um, give this video a thumbs up and comment. I'm trying to think of something for you guys to comment down below. Um, hmm. Cause we're, it's spooky season. So comment your favorite like um, horror movie. Comment your favorite horror movie down below. We'll go with that. So today's video, um, this is a brand I've never tried before. I saw this palette on Instagram and I was like, I absolutely have to have this palette. It is so beautiful. It screams fall and spooky season and that is the Creatures of Forever palette by Rebel Rouge Labs. Here's the back. And here is the inside of this palette. You guys, this is just so fun, so beautiful. I'm really, really excited to get started with this. Um, Probably, yeah, I'm gonna try and swing that um, two eye look, look. Gosh, you guys, I don't know what it is, I swear to you. I never, very rarely, do I get the hiccups and I try to film and it's like they just start coming. So I don't know, I don't know what that's about, but I apologize. <laughs> okay, so I am thinking, hmm. Yeah, I was trying to figure out like what shades I would wanna do to make this work. So we'll figure it out. Um, I think, I think I have a plan. Do I? Hmm. My husband's always like, you need to figure this out before you start filming because it takes forever. So I'm sorry he edits these videos. Um, I'm just seeing so many pretty shades and hmm. My brain, I've just been having a lot going on. So it's like I am having a lot of trouble focusing and like I'll think of something, but then like it's gone like that from my brain. Sorry, there's like a bug flying around. Um, and so it's really hard for me to figure things out because it's like my brain is on overload and it's like as soon as I think of something, it's gone. Cause like I'll get in my head like, okay, I'm gonna do this, but then yeah, I, I lose it. I, I keep thinking something, but I'm like, would this work? And, hmm. Honestly, like, my main thing is I'm trying to figure out what crease shades I want to go in with, which is really, really funny because, like, it shouldn't be that big of a deal. But I'm, like, hyper-focused but also can't focus. It's it's crazy to live in my brain some days. Um, okay, let's... Hmm. Hmm. Y'all. I just need to pick a shade and go. Because we going to be here all day at this rate and like I got stuff to do, y'all got stuff to do. So let's just, you know, it's spooky season. We're going to start with the shade Spooksville right here and we're just going to hope that these two looks kind of work out. So let's see what happens. This is a really, really pretty yellow. So let's just go with that starting out. It shows up, you can see it. Very happy with that. Very, very happy. Oh, that, that's pretty. I like it. I like it. Also, my allergies have been horrible. So the skin on my eyes is like peeling off. It's a whole thing. That's what happens to me every time the seasons change. Um, I'm hoping that when it finally cools off here in the Midwest where I live, which like isn't going to happen to like November, um, that it will get better. But yeah, I'm just, oh, it sucks. Cause like I can see it and it's, it's nothing to do with the shadow. Like literally my eyelids are just so irritated and red and inflamed and cracking and sometimes they bleed. It's a whole thing. I just, th that's why like I always say I'm scared because I don't know that I could like go through like another couple of season changes here because it's like literally just destroying me and 
yeah, it's, it's not cool. Okay, so now I'm gonna do like a halo type eye, um, but the issue is what shade do I, what deeper shade do I wanna go in with next? Hmm. You know what? We're gonna go in with the shade Midnight Club, which this looks like a, I can't tell if it's like, a, I can't tell if it's like black or more of like a blue black or gray charcoal color. The lights do sometimes play with your eyes and things look different. So let's just, let's see how this goes. Okay, I think it's like, I think it's a black shade. That's how it's looking right now. Yeah, like I know that sounds funny, but there are some times where I absolutely cannot tell what a shade is just because like the lights um, just make it like shift. So it's hard to tell, but I think this is like a black shade. I'm just gonna gently try and lightly connect this together. And again, like if my eyes are looking rough, like it's nothing to do with the shadow. These are performing beautifully. It is strictly my allergies and the fact that my eyelids are just getting destroyed a little more each day. And it's like extremely painful. Like it's, it's not fun. Okay. Now I'm gonna put a little bit of my glitter glue in the center of my eye. Just a little bit. Now we have to pick a shade to put in the middle of the eye, which I keep going back and forth. Now I can't find my brush. I'm trying to figure out what shade I wanna put in the center of the eye because, so I did yellow and black. I think the next eye is gonna be like orange and this like deep maroon shade so i'm like trying to figure out what would look the best with this and what would look the best with that because i want the shade to be a little different but i'm also not sure hold on i just want to okay i'm just going to swatch these shades really quick this is the shade time terror which is right here because i just want to see how these are going to look Ooh. okay that's pretty and then Ancient Evil, which is the shade right here. Ooh. Okay, these are, oh, so that's right there. And then Chain Letter, which is this one right here. These are phenomenal, you guys. These are, oh my God, so, oh, can you see that? Like, so just... I mean, they're so soft and creamy and, okay, now the shade Phantom, which is the shade right here. These are just, oh, you guys, these are, okay, that one's a little harder to see. If you can't see that, I'm sorry. Um, then Evil Thirst, which is this one right here. Right there. Okay, that's a really, really cool shift. And then Spellbound, which is this one right here. Okay. These are all really, really, really pretty. And I totally, hmm. I, th no, oh man, I hate when I get like this, it's like, what is going on in my brain? What do I want to do? Let's go with, you know what? Let's just go with ancient evil in the center of the eye. That's this one right here. These are all so pretty. So it's like, you can't go wrong, but I want something a little different than the other shades that are on the eye, if that makes any sense. Oh my goodness. What just happened? Okay that 
Okay, yeah, like I said, the lights make these shades look totally different. I was not expecting this, but I absolutely love this. Like, oh my gosh, you guys, that is, that is so beautiful. Holy crap. Oh my, God. it's so, like, oh my gosh. I absolutely love what just happened. And I, I was thinking that that was gonna be more of like a blue, but for some reason it's totally, and maybe it could be with the lights, it's pulling more like greenish, but it is like the most amazing, beautiful shade. Like that's just, whew, that one got me. Like I was not expecting that. Okay, that was just, Shoot, 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 shoot. Sorry. Throwing my color swatch all over the place. Okay, that. I can't get over how, okay, that's just beautiful. That is just so pretty. Okay, focus. All right, now I need to do my lower lash line. Dang, like I just feel like nothing that I could do now could even top that. Like that is just the, mm, so pretty. Okay, lower lash line. Let's do the shade Final Friends, which is that pretty purple shade right there. You guys can hear the train going by. Just never know what you're gonna hear when I'm filming. All right. Now for a lower inner corner highlight. Um, dang, what do I want to do? I think I want to go with, let's try the shade Evil Thirst, which is that shade right there. Cause I'm, I'm just curious to see how that's gonna look on the eyes. Like these shades are like so soft. They're like, this one is like almost like a cream. Ooh, okay, that's cool. That is, really cool that's like stars in a night sky like just absolutely <gasps> sorry I'm like my palette almost dumped over okay that is just okay now for the other eye I'm like dang how can we even top this like I don't think it's possible, but we're gonna try, or at least just come up with something pretty, kind of close to it. Okay, so now what did I say we're gonna do? I think I said we're gonna start with orange, right? I think that's what I said. So let's go with the shade Die Softly, which is that really, really, really pretty orange shade. This is like the perfect like pumpkin orange. Oh, that's pretty, you guys. That is so pretty. Hello, beautiful. Okay. So that, yeah, that is like pumpkin orange right there.
All right, now we're gonna go in with that really pretty like maroonish purple shade. I'll show you in one second. It is called Bury Me Deep and it is that shade right there. And we're just kind of gonna do the same thing, kind of like a halo eye. And just hope that these shades like merge well together. I love these shades together like they just this just screams fall to me it just looks so cool all right now I gotta grab that glitter glue this time I actually know what shade I'm gonna go in with in the center so that's gonna make it a lot better Need to find that brush. Like I swear I don't have that many brushes, but it is just hard to find the brush you're looking for. Every time. Okay, so for the center of the eye, we're gonna go in with the shade Time Terror, which is right here. And I feel like that's gonna look really, really cool. So hopefully I am correct in that guess. Yes, 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 yes. Oh, you guys. This might be like the fall look right now. For me anyway. Oh my gosh, yes. This is, I love, love this. Love. Oh, that is. Okay. Okay. I did, I, I don't know. I don't know which one I like the most right now. Because they are both just so, so beautiful. Okay. I think I want to just go in with that yellow shade Spooksville. And just kind of like bring that up just a little bit more. Because that got a little higher with that orange shade. So there we go. Okay. Now. Got to do the lower lash line over here. Which again requires me finding a brush. I just, it's like, I just, I don't know how I do this. I am just the best at like, I guess when I go, I put it closer to me, but then when I go to grab another brush, it gets moved <sighs> and it just gets all over the place. So we're going to go in with the shade Remember Me, which is that really pretty pink shade. And that's going to be our lower lash line shade. is so pretty just I just I love everything about fall you guys just there's just something about it it's like I feel like I really come to life in the fall and I can really be one with nature and that's just something that is really really important to me okay now I guess we're gonna go in with this shade chain letter which is right here and that's gonna be the lower inner corner highlight I just dipped into the wrong shade. 
I think I just get so excited at the thought of fall and getting to be outside and just seeing the trees change and just feeling that cool breeze. It's just, it just, it literally just does something to me and it's, it's just the most amazing thing. Okay, this shade. If you guys are like around my age and you loved skating and you would go to like the roller rinks and you know how they had those like glow sticks? And like sometimes you tie them like onto your skates and look so cool when you were going fast around the rink. Okay, total nostalgia moment there, but this shade is like the blue glow stick color. It just, it looks amazing. I just absolutely love it. So I'm gonna go do my mascara and I'll be right back. I am back and these are the finished looks. And these are just so fun, so beautiful. And also, um, y'all know if there are any products that I absolutely love, I just, I want to share them with you. So on my lips, this is the ColourPop Luxe Lipstick in the shade Still Crazy. This is just absolutely beautiful, beautiful lip shade. And then I have been just absolutely loving this blush from ColourPop. Um, it's the Super Shock blush and it's the shade Lil Vibe. It's purple, but it, it 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 just it is the most beautiful purple, and I feel like it would look gorgeous on anyone. It is just so pretty, and it pairs especially well with my favorite highlighter in the entire world. I'm gonna show you guys this, and you're gonna be like, "Holy crap, you use that all the time!" And I do. 99.9% .9 of the time, my highlight is the Ladybug Glow Cotton Candy Highlighter. And it is just, you guys, look at what a mess this is. Like, I have one more that I have not touched, but I just, I use this so much. Like, do you see that huge, like, pan um, <laughs> that is showing? Because, like, I, I literally, I wear this all the time. It is just so beautiful. I absolutely adore it. Um, if you do want to save 10% on any Ladybug Glow products, you can use my code Ashley, A-S-H-L-E-Y. Um, and again, I just, I love this highlighter. Like, I've never, I mean, like, I'm a highlighter fan, but I've never had one that I just continue to reach for, and that's what this is for me. And if it, like, if I run out and they don't make it anymore, I'm gonna be really, really sad, because, like, I literally, I don't know what I'm gonna do, because I love this so much. So, anyway... You guys, I just, like I said, if there are any products that I'm just absolutely in love with, I try to um, show those to you guys. So, today's video um, was the Creatures of Forever palette by Rebel Rouge Labs. This palette performed so well. Here's the inside of that palette. I absolutely adore this. Again, this is the first time that I've tried Rebel Rouge Labs. Um, I am a new fan. I cannot wait to try more of their products. Um, I know this just, I got it, it was like at the end of the pre-sale. So I don't know the status of what's going on, if they still have any available, but go check out their site because I am sure that all of their palettes are phenomenal with it as well as this one performed. So I think that is it for this video. Thank you guys so much for your love, your support. Subscribe to my channel if you're not already subscribed. Comment, again, your favorite horror movie down below. Or if you don't like horror movies, just your favorite movie in general. It's cool. I know I'm a horror lover, but I know some people don't like it. So if you're not down with horror stuff, just comment your favorite movie down below. Just please remember that you're loved, you're amazing, and just have a wonderful day, night, morning, whatever it is, wherever you are, and I'll see y'all in the next one.